Hello YouTubers, this is Eric from Nola Cake Studio. Today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how to do edible image cutouts uh, using your Cricut Explorer Air or Cricut machine. Now there's some things you need uh, in preparation of doing this. Uh, first thing you're going to need is a uh, edible printer. I use Canon. All right, you're going to need edible paper. All right, you're going to need a computer. All right, and you're going to also need your Cricut Air or your Cricut machine and a mat. All right, so these are the things you're going to need uh, to do uh, this procedure to make these. Real simple guys, if you watched my first video, uh, I showed you how to do these Cricut cutouts. But today I'm going to give you this uh, tutorial on how to do it on edible paper. So it's real simple guys, basically what you want to do, and let's go to the PC, and let's go grab an image. Alright, so I'm going to go to my PC here guys, and um, I am going to grab an image. Uh, let's go ahead on and do the Ninja Turtle. All right, so I'm just using a basic PC. I'm going to use a Ninja Turtle, and uh, I am going to insert the image into the Cricut uh, space. Kind of get y'all guys to see this. And as you can see, that um, it is there now. So what I want to do is kind of drag it. And I want to make it a little bigger. So I kind of use it like this, and I am going to kind of drag it a little bit to make it bigger. Kind of use my mouse a little bit. All right, so let's go to the drag it larger all right so I try to get it about uh, you know from one to five just about four inches all right and uh, so I'm kind of dupe it and kind of get two of them in here if I can all right and uh, from there let's go on and go to hit go real simple and uh, what this program does on the Cricut design space is it's going to go take those two images and voila, it has it both there. Now, from here, I'm going to hit go. And uh, it brings me to the next portion, uh, which I can print the page, which that's what I want to do. I'm going to print the page. And I do have my Canon uh, plugged up. So I got my Canon plugged up here. And uh, we're going to go on to print it. Now, I'm, again, I'm using edible paper real quick. And I'm going to print it. So uh, basically, guys, uh, once this print come out, I'm going to show you how it come out here on my Canon and uh, go from there. So uh, what this is going to do is just like with your car stock paper, it's going to give you the uh, the lines and everything. So uh, let's go on the pan over here to the printer and let y'all guys see uh, the, the cutout here. All right, as you can see that it is printing and it does have the Cricut lines. Again, this is edible paper. All right, so boom, there it is. All right, so what we're gonna do next is we're gonna take this paper and we're gonna put it on our mat. So let's go ahead and go to our Cricut space. All right, guys, so I do have uh, the edible image that's going on the Cricut space to kind of push down on a little bit, all right? All right, so the Cricut is ready, and we can go ahead and slide it in here to the Cricut space. And as you can see, that the Cricut is going to recognize uh, the lines here. That is the, uh, the way the Cricut works. As you can tell, that the Cricut is cutting the image right on uh, the, the edible image paper here. No problem. All right, so my cut is done here, uh, as you can see. Uh, so let's go ahead and pull this off the mat and see what we get. I still have the plastic that's on the edible image. Uh, so let's pull this off real easy. Just yank it off. All right, so let's move this out the way. And uh, let's go ahead and pull off our image paper here. And kind of pull that off. Real, so you got to remember that this is uh, edible paper, so it's really soft. You got to be, it's kind of delicate, but it works. Kind of get that in there so y'all guys can see this. All right, so let's go ahead and pull this off so you guys can see. 
that is really, really simple. It's not hard to do. And again, all I used was the Cricut uh, program to do this. Real easy, real simple. And again, it's edible, so uh, it don't matter if you rip the outer portion. Just want to kind of get that in there. All right. And you want to kind of be real, real delicate with this because if not, then you risk ripping the image. All right, so we're going to do that. Get all that off and boola, voila. Here we go. Take this right off the paper and there you have it. So you have an edible image, good to go, ready to go for your uh, candy apple or your cake that you can put this right on and it's all edible. And uh, so, yeah, if you have any questions, please leave your comments down below. If you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. And for more information, please visit us at uh, www.nolacakestudio.com. This is Eric. See you guys on the next video. Peace.